Good morning and welcome. You're watching the Comics FX Daily Outlook for Tuesday, September the 30th, 2014. The euro rose 0.14% against the US dollar and closed at 1.2690. On the macro front, consumer prices in Germany came in flat on a monthly basis in September, similar to the unchanged reading registered in the previous month. In other economic news, the Eurozone's economic sentiment indicator recorded a drop to 99.9 in September. In the US, pending home sales dropped 1% on a monthly basis in August, more than market expectations. The pair is expected to find support at 1.2667, and a fall through could take it to the next support level of 1.2639. The pair is expected to find first resistance at 1.2719, and a rise through could take it to the next resistance level of 1.2743. Trading trends in the euro today would be determined by the Eurozone's crucial CPI as well as the unemployment data scheduled in a few hours. The British pound rose 0.06% against the US dollar and closed at 1.6243. Net consumer credit in the UK advanced by 0.9 billion pounds in August, more than market expectations of 0.8 billion pounds. It had risen by 1.1 billion pounds in the previous month. Meanwhile, the number of mortgage approvals for the housing purchases in Britain dropped to 64.2k. Overnight data indicated that the GFK consumer confidence in the UK eased to minus 1 in September. The pair is expected to find support at 1.6220 and a fall through could take it to the next support level of 1.6187. The pair is expected to find stress resistance at 1.6281 and a rise through could take it to the next resistance level of 1.6309. Trading trends in the pound today would be determined by the Britain's crucial GDP figures. The US dollar weakened 0.06% against the Japanese yen and closed at 109.40. Earlier today, data indicated that unemployment rates in Japan unexpectedly dropped to 3.5% in August, registering a 16-year low, lower than market expectations to rise to 3.8% and following a similar level registered in the previous month. Meanwhile, industrial production in Japan unexpectedly eased 1.5% on a monthly basis in August, less than market expectations for an advance of 0.2% and compared to 0.4% rise registered in the previous month. The US dollar declined 0.12% against the Swiss franc and closed at 0.9511. The pair is expected to find support at 0.9485 and a fall through could take it to the next support level of 0.9464. The pair is expected to find stress resistance at 0.9531 and a rise through could take it to the next resistance level of 0.9556. Trading trends in the Swiss franc today is expected to be determined by the Switzerland KOF leading indicator scheduled in a few hours. That was our final currency pair for today. On a final note, check out our 10k promotion. All you have to do is open a live trading account and you have the chance of withdrawing a bonus of $10,000. Stay in the know by liking us on Facebook, following us on Twitter and Instagram, circling us on Google+, and of course, subscribing to our YouTube channel. Have a great trading day!